Howdy folks, Dan Rubino here with Windows Phone Central. I just want to give you a quick look here at Gleek for Windows Phone 8. It has already been submitted to the Windows Phone Store, which means it should be out within the next few days. As you can see here, I'm rocking a double wide tile, and it actually will give you uh, any update information on the, the little counter down here. You don't see it right now because I just happened to check. Uh, the tile also flips and will give you your daily status and any new mentions. Uh, on top of that though, the developer Liquid Daffodil has taken full advantage of Windows Phone 8. So for instance, this wallpaper here is derived from their servers. So every day this wallpaper will get pushed to your device and you'll get a new one. And if you've used their apps in the past, you know that their wallpaper selection is actually pretty nice. So you can also use this wallpaper within the app itself or just have it go to the lock screen. Um, you can also see today's activity, timeline updates 100, new mentions 13. So you can have it show you know information there. And although I don't have any new uh, data, you can also have it selected as a counter. You can see I actually have Skype right there with 10 notifications for chats that have come in. So likewise, you can choose those. Uh, the app itself also does voice commands. So we're gonna try that right now. Gleek, new tweet. Creating new tweet. And there you go, right into a new tweet box. So it saves you a few extra seconds, depending if you pin that to your screen or not. And sometimes if you're trying to save time or your hands are full, obviously that can be quite useful. Uh, there's also some other, and you can do that for a couple different commands, of course. But um, probably one of the more interesting ones, I think, are these sort of smart voice commands. So we'll give an example of that. If you go to your timeline and you're browsing through something, so say Brad Sam's there uh, from Windside, and I want to either retweet or reply to that or quote, you can just launch it, reply. And so you just say what you wanna do. You have about a 15 second window to say that command it's it's an interesting thing i wasn't even aware windows phone 8 can kind of do that now they disabled directly any feedback for that to sort of make it faster because it would be kind of annoying and intrusive the very time you did those commands you had a um a box coming in and telling you that but you can sort of do that for like i said a few commands quote and so there you go my quote comes up and i can just add any info I want to that message or, you know, just send it as is. So actually stuff like that is pretty cool. Also, when you launch the app, you can tell it uh, compose instead of new tweet. Uh, and that will also create an app, uh, a new tweet for you. So there are quite a few options and there is an Easter egg here, which I'll demonstrate on camera. It is pretty funny. As you guys all know, Liquid Daffodil makes some pretty humorous uh, jokes within their app. So here's one. Gleek, I'm a douche. Loading retweets of you because you have a big ego, but low self-esteem. <laughs> so there you go. Um, you gotta love stuff like that. So this actually, I mean, it's actually kind of useful for some people. It directly shows you who's retweeted everything you wrote. And I suppose if you have a big ego but low self-esteem, you'll be checking this stuff out. So uh, there's a, a few other features, of course. Uh, in this you can of course resize that tile to make it small medium or large and let me hop to the settings and let me just quickly show you that the new options you have here under lock screen so you already kind of see I chose Gleek as my background so I described that before uh, you can also choose here what shows so a lot of you guys on windows phone 7 just have calendar that's your only option windows phone 8 allows you to show whatever you want basically on that next screen and if a third party app takes advantage of that you can so choose so you could also have skype to show you your latest messages which is kind of cool and then down here you can choose your lock screen notifications to even add more information to there so here you can just choose gleek there's actually no icon there but it does show up i confirmed it works so there you go quick preview of Gleek for Windows Phone 8 should be out within the next few days. Pretty fun app, voice commands, lock screen wallpaper, notifications, and even some humor as always. So there you go, check out in the Windows Phone store, head to WP Central, and we'll keep you up to date when that app hits live. Take care, everybody.